when I'm looking at the pictures, I'm looking for a pizza box. I mean, I found the beer can. I got the beer can. Where are the pizza boxes? Well, we found a couple of cigarette butts. A few golf balls as well. Oh, yeah, not to mention the golf balls. There's hundreds of them everywhere, right? And baseballs. And, of course, that's even in the cue cards for Apollo 12. All of that content's in the cue card. Don't forget the baseball, right, is in the cue cards. Right? Yeah. We were talking about the Apollo funnies. When you put these two together, what it shows is it shows one fella, Jack Schmidt here. He doesn't have a bubble helmet in there. Well, we already went over that last week. Yeah. But watch what happens when you put these two together. And I just thought this was kind of funny. Yeah, no bubble helmet. So now you can see why they would not have a helmet in there. Because let's face it, they smoke like chimneys. <laughs> yeah, there he is. He's smoking. Where's a helmet? Dear, oh dear. If you look at the timeline of Apollo, Apollo 11 that was, None of the astronauts had access to any of those rocks when they did that tour. The rocks were in quarantine. Nobody knew what they were. So they couldn't have presented them with anything. I mean, it's a great story. And it's yet another part of the whole Apollo humor. You know, oh, let's fool everybody with a piece of petrified wood. No, it was a genuine mistake. So let's not get too tied up with people finding bits of rock in somebody's effects after they uh, had died. I mean, it was a, whether it was a genuine mistake or it was a deliberate bit of humor, I don't know. It doesn't really matter. The other thing is, is NASA likes to throw in stuff because they lost chain of custody of the rocks. An yep. entire filing cabinet and just... What's that? Yeah, there rock, we go. Rocks in a filing cabinet were removed. They lose chain of custody. So whatever they claim that they got back, are they the real rocks? Because they have no idea. No, no idea at all. They may well have been switched because Moon Rock would fetch a lot of money on eBay when it was going to be invented a few years later. And I'm sure that somebody would say, oh, I've got a bit of Moon Rock. Yes, I've got a piece of Moon Rock. Come on, guys, here it is. Lovely piece of Moon Rock, that one. Come on, get it if you yeah. want. You know, million dollars, something like that. That'll, that'll do me. Million dollars, piece of Moon Rock. Well, you see, they lose the chain of custody of everything. Yeah, and if they do come and get it, I'll know it's real. Yeah, and then they got petrified cookie dough for it. Yep. But you look at all the films, they lose chain of custody. Oh, they're just left in a vacant McDonald's. They didn't have custody of those films. The only thing is with the films is you look at it and you know that they shot it on their simulated set because you can go back and match what's in the videos. Right?